This is Keith Berkelheimer and this is ReefBun TV. A few weeks ago I provided a step-by-step -step guide on how to use a Canon DSLR to stream live to Facebook. You can check out that video by clicking on this link. I want to follow up that video with a neat trick I learned while learning how to stream live to Facebook. As many of you know, DSLR cameras have a digital zoom feature that allows you to zoom in very closely to focus on the subject matter. With my Canon 5D Mark III, I'm able to zoom in five times as well as ten times. The rub is you can't snap pictures or record video to the camera at these ultra close ranges as macro lenses and extension tubes are the primary means to get close. I have heard of folks using a magnifying glass, but I have not attempted to do this trick. Nonetheless, I have discovered a way to overcome this limitation and actually record ultra close up photos and video without using a macro lens or extension tubes. You can do it using the same apps used to stream live to Facebook. Please note this tutorial is specifically for Canon DSLRs and Macs, although I'm sure it is doable in Windows and for other DSLRs. To start, you will need a USB cable to connect the camera to the computer as well as the Canon EOS utility, Camera Live, Cam Twist, and OBS. Follow the links in the description of the video to download the apps. For my camera, I am only able to record the 5 times zoom, but this is still an amazing improvement over what the lens is capable of doing. However, when you use a macro lens and or extension tubes, you can get even closer. Here is the view of what my macro lens can record, and here is what it can record using the 5 times digital zoom. Check out those details. Once everything is loaded onto your Mac, you can follow a series of steps to record what you see in digital zoom. Step number one, open up camera live. You then connect the DSLR to the Mac with the USB cable and turn on the DSLR in video mode. You next launch cam twist. Click on the view in the menu at the top and then main menu. Double click siphon under the step one menu and then select camera live as the siphon server. Next, minimize both the Camera Live and Cam Twist apps. You then open up OBS. Make sure you have Video Capture Device selected under Sources. Select Settings. Select the Video tab and make sure you have the Base Canvas Resolution set to 2560 by 1440, the Output Scaled Resolution set to 1920 by 1080, the downscale filter at bi-cube sharpening scaling 16 samples and the common FPS value set to 30. Next select the output tab. Under recording choose the destination for the video to be saved to. For recording quality select indistinguishable quality large file size. Choose a recording format I use .mov. Select software by 264 for encoder. Click OK to go back to the main menu. Hit start recording. Press the digital zoom on the DSLR and you are now off to the races. The last step is to crank down the volume on your computer speakers. If you don't then you will get some bad echoing on the audio recording. And one very important thing to note, don't totally mute the volume. If you do then it will cause the video to buffer. Just go with one bar of sound. Once you are finished recording, you can go to the folder where the video is saved to view the finished product. A super close-up video captured by your camera's digital zoom. You can then bring the file into your video editing software to make any necessary adjustments such as sharpening up the video. As for photos, in my video editing software, Adobe's Premiere Elements, I can actually grab a frame of the video and export it as a bitmap file. So ultra close-up pictures can be generated as well, all possible by utilizing the above procedure to record what is seen on the camera's digital zoom.
Many thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel to be alerted to my latest videos.